It's my pleasure to be here this morning and, and talk about another important activity in this community and this city called Aurora. And it is an involvement in community, uh, young people and old people, seniors, <laughs> people like me, right? Thanks. Okay. Like us. Uh, uh, you're not there yet. <laughs> right. But um, it's my pleasure and honor to read uh, the following proclamation. Whereas 2014 is the 12th year of the National Mentoring Month, which was first endorsed by President George W. Bush, and whereas the month of January has been designated as National Mentoring Month as a tribute to the men and women who help young people in need and create a bond from multiple generations, and whereas mentors know that helping a child grow to grow and be successful begins with caring adults who provide guidance and support. A supportive mentor can be the difference in a child's struggle or success. And whereas the community has always had more youth needing mentors than adults willing to be mentors, and whereas Aurora desires to provide its citizens with a superior quality of life, including support for the development of our youth, and now, therefore, I, Stephen D. Hogan, Mayor of the City of Aurora, do hereby proclaim the month of January 2014 as the City of Aurora Mentor Awareness Month, in witness whereof I have hereunto set my hand and caused the seal of the City of Aurora, Colorado, to be affixed this 13th day of January 2014. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, comments? Mary? We are very lucky in the city of Aurora to have several mentoring organizations that work with the youth in the city of Aurora, and many of them are represented here today. So I think um, if we have time, I would like to have them introduce themselves and their organization that yes. are here. Please do. Hi, everyone. <laughs> I'm Vicki Scott with Aurora Mental Health Center and we have a mentoring program, Aurora Youth Options, that works with middle and high school youth. I'm Liz Van Lanningham from the Community College of Aurora. Hi, I'm Dave Ryan with Big Brothers Big Sisters. We're thrilled to be here. Thank you, Mayor. Uh, we're thrilled to be a part of the America's Promise Coalition and a part of the Aurora community in helping kids. My name is Keith Bailey. I'm with the City of Aurora's Office of Youth Development. My name is Dave Lucid with Friends for Youth Mentoring. Uh, we're glad to be here. I'm Reed Hedick with the Aurora Community of Faith, and we're happy to support these great groups and uh, encourage mentoring among our members. I'm Daniel Neighbors, and I'm with Save Our Youth Mentoring, and uh, we're just really excited to be a part of what's going on in Aurora with all the mentoring. Hi, I'm Terry Gillen. I'm with Friends for Youth Executive Director, and we work with the youth in the juvenile justice system and also with the foster care youth, and we're very glad to be a part of this organization. Hi, I'm Angie Turbyfill, and I'm also with Friends for Youth Mentoring. Hi, my name is Ken Brerman. I'm also with Aurora Youth Options, and we're excited to be here and a part of the community. My name is Angelia Baker. I'm with Promoting Safe and Stable Families, and I'm a mentor with Aurora Youth Options. And I'm Tom Barrett. I'm the director of Parks, Recreation, and Open Space Department. I just want to say thank you for all the partners that we have in working with our staff, Keith Bailey and, uh, and Kathy, um, on everything that we wind up doing through the Parks, Recreation, and Open Space Department. Thank you so much. And, Mayor, thanks for coming out this morning and, and uh, reading the proclamation and making this uh, an official process for us. Thank you. Thank you all for being here and best of luck in this great city called Aurora. Thank you. 